I'm Sarah Hashimwaris for Smart Trend News, and this is your market close wrap up for May 6, 2010. The major U.S. equity indices closed lower Thursday as market flubs took precedence over Greece and other European debt. U.S. stocks reported their highest percentage decline since April 2009, with all three major indices closing down over 3 percent. The Labor Department reported that new claims for jobless benefits dropped to 444,000 last week, missing economist predictions of a decline of 440,000. The Labor Department said in another report that Q1 productivity increased 3.6 percent at an annual rate, beating economists' expectations of 2.5 percent. In corporate news, Procter & Gamble shares suddenly dropped this afternoon, and a spokesperson for the company said she is not sure what might have caused the sudden decline, but the company is looking into the matter. Analysts are dubbing the flub fat finger trading, and some are pointing to computerized trading as the culprit. Taking a look at where the markets closed, the Dow Jones Industrial Average finished 3.2 percent lower at 10,520, the S&P 500 declined 3.2 percent at 1,128, and the Nasdaq Composite finished 3.4 percent lower, 2,319. I'm Sarah Hashimwaris for Smart Trend News. For more news and market analysis, visit our website, tradethetrend.com, or subscribe to our YouTube channel, Trade the Trend.